Welcome to YouTubers Love Excel number 44. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link and download the workbook YouTubers Love Excel 41 to 48. Hey, trick number 44. This is a, a trick I just learned from John Mo one at MrExcel.com. Uh, in an earlier video, we posted uh, some we had some people had this person had trouble with time because it was coming up as text and we gave great examples uh, in the last couple videos I posted on time but this is just a variation and we'll look at all four four different ways to convert a text formula um, from text to a number and then we'll look three examples of converting a text number to a number and this is a common co problem here. You have uh, the number 20, but it's entered as text. And although that 20 can work in some formulas, it will not work in all formulas. So sometimes we need to convert this text to numbers. All right, let's start with the text formulas. Let's click right here and hit F2. Here is a formula that is converting this number to a text. Escape click right here. I'm going to control shift tilde or apply the general formatting because of course time, when you enter time, I'm going to control Z, enter time 8 colon 00, zero space AM. It's not really 8 AM, it's the proportion of one 24 hour day. So when I control shift tilde to show general, we see that that's one third of the way through the day. Control Z. But this text formula right here took that number and converted it to text. And sometimes people do that. Now, how do you convert it back? There are four ways. You can plus 0 and then enter. Notice that text is always aligned to the left and numbers are aligned to the right. So immediately you can see that that's a number. Another way when we come here, I'm going to hit F2, is to multiply times 1. Enter. Another way if I hit F2 is to divide by 1. Enter. Another way, and this is the trick I learned from John Mo 1, is you could do a double negative. Double negative. Enter. Oh, but wait a second. That one gets rid of the formatting, too. So I'm simply going to click uh, in this cell, Control-1, and go back to time. Now let's see how to do uh, numbers. And we're going to use Paste Special. We have a number here. And even though it's entered with an apostrophe, this trick will get rid of the apostrophe. We're going to use Paste Special. The way you does do it is you can either add 0, multiply by 1, or divide by 1. So I'm going to copy that 0. And you would never really do it for one cell like this. If it was one cell, you'd just get rid of the apostrophe escape. The, this, these tricks are for when you have huge columns of numbers and you don't want to do each one by hand. You type a 0 somewhere, copy, click on the cell, right click Paste Special, and say in the Operations section of Paste Special, let's say Add. And it adds 0. But notice what it does. It's not like over here where we had to create an actual formula plus 0. It actually added the 0, took away the apostrophe, and converted it to a number. Let's try it with the number 1. Control C, right, right click, Paste Special. And this one will multiply by 1. It did the same thing. It got rid of the apostrophe. Finally, Control C, right click, Paste Special. And we'll say divide by 1. All right, that's a bunch about uh, numbers and text and how to convert, whether it's a formula or a number, from text back to a number. All right, we'll see you next YouTube trick.